Well, Evite Teloni was was uh, meaning the wastrels or the, right. the the guys who just fellows who just hang out. Right. Really, right. these are thirty two year old guys who live still live at their mothers. Sounds don't like work. sounds like Main Street. Yeah, sounds to me. like Main exactly. <laughs> and um, um, when I saw it, I saw it after La Strada. Actually, I think it was made before La Strada, though. Yeah. And um, the combination of uh, of um, the lifestyle showing these five gen these five guys in the small town of Rimini, which is the, his hometown, really was kind of an autobiographical film of his. Um, that and the humor, the humor of it was very important. Alberto Sordi and, and the type of humor they had, which was very much the street humor that I grew up with. And I, I went to look at the film and I began to realize that um, um, I was aiming towards making pictures about my friends and myself anyway, but that was it. When I finally saw Evie Teloni, I said, well, that's the only way. You were confirmed in your own instincts. Absolutely. I mean, if he could do it about Rimini, I could do it about Elizabeth Street. Yeah. And, um, and also, it, uh, Evie Teloni finds its way into Goodfellas, too. Yes. They introduced the characters the same way. There was Jimmy and Tommy and me, and there was Anthony Stabile. How are you doing? Frankie Carbone. And then there was Mo Black's brother, Fat Andy. And his guys, Frankie the Wop. Freddie No Nose. Naturalmente, ci siamo anche noi. I vitelloni. Questo è Alberto. Questo è Leopoldo, l'intellettuale. Ed ecco Moraldo, che è il più giovane della nostra compagnia. Ehi, guarda che bello, Uh, there's lots of new techniques used, and uh, the relationships of the people to their parents and, and uh, to the girlfriends and uh, the marriage, uh, all of that meant it was almost, it was very, very close to the world I grew up in, mm -hmm. you know.